Hello there, today we are making another silky dress but 60 style. It will be shorter than it should be to make it in a modern way. This is the pattern from the front top with pants, front opening and long sleeves made in this way for curling. It's half pattern but you have to fold the fabric in two so as not to have to stitch in front. I chose this shiny fabric to enhance the effect of the dress. This is the back and this time you don't need to fold the fabric because you'll put the zip in the exact center of the back. The pattern for the front of the skirt with pants also need to fold the fabric in two as the top. The back of the skirt doesn't need it yet for the zip. So this is how the front top looks like after the cut. You need to leave signs for pants you will sew later. And this is the shape for sleeves to make them curled. This is the back of the top cut enough for the zip and with the same shape for sleeves. So the top in the front and in the back. And at first it should look like this. The neckline need more steps to be completed, adding two pieces of fabric inside to make it consistent. And for last we will curl under the breast and sleeves. And this is how the back look like. To curl the edges, insert the thread and pull it until you like how it looks. This is how it turns out. For the neckline I sewed two pieces of fabric inside with the same shape of the neckline and I added the adhesive lap to make it more rigid. Then I secured the fabric with invisible stitches. Now let's talk about the skirt. This is the front with signs for pants. This is the back where I sewed it down, leaving at the top the space for the zip. So you just need to sew the front to the back and all the pants and the skirt is ready to be sewed to the top. At the end, make all the finishes as the hem, the zip and the dress is done. And this is the result. Really classy but at the same time modern, elegant and impressive. You just need to find the right shiny silky fabric and you're halfway there. Thanks for watching and I hope you liked the video. See you next time, bye!